A state lawmaker wants officers to get new training if they want to work in schools. A bill discussed today in Santa Fe would give those officers different training than they're used to. News 13's Rachel Knapp is live at the Roundhouse to explain. Kim, the bill sponsor says school resource officers get training when it comes to protecting students, but not enough training when it comes to that community aspect. And granted, our police officers we have in the schools right now, um, they're doing a really good job in keeping our schools safe, but identifying additional training that would give them more information about how do you engage your school community, how do you work and be a resource for students, families, and people within that school community. Representative Patricia Rolova, who is a current school resource officer for APS, is spearheading House Bill 184. It would require SROs to get more extensive training on crisis management, how to respond to students with mental and behavioral issues, and how to mentor students. It would also help fund getting equipment for those officers. Right now, the bill is getting bipartisan support. Most of these folks that are working as school resource officers are retired police officers in some regard, so they have a you know a good basis on how to how to operate as a police officer. But that's a whole different ballgame when you're doing that within the confines of a school. You're dealing with you know children and, and you know folks that aren't quite adult age yet. So there's a whole different way that that has to be handled. I think it's vital that we get. The bill was heard today in the House Judiciary Committee, but it was not voted on. Some of the committee men members wanted to clarify. If a little bit of the language in the bill before they could put it to a vote. Kim. Okay, thanks, Rachel. Now, the bill would give school districts an extra $1,000 for each SRO to get that specialized training. The money would come from the Law Enforcement Protection Fund.